Guys, in today's video, we are once again talking about the Wanderer aspect for the Brood Weaver Strand Warlock. We've already made a video breaking down a build for this aspect. It's a very strong aspect, but it does have a hidden feature that it doesn't actually tell you about. That's what we're going to be covering in today's video. Before we get into it though, if you're going to enjoy, remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already, as there's a lot of you who watch my content that aren't actually subscribed. Doing so is free to do and it really helps me out here a lot. We're also super close to hitting 500 subscribers, halfway to 1,000, which is my goal to hit by the end of the year. So if you could help me reach that goal, I would greatly appreciate it. But let's just jump into today's video. So the Wanderer aspect, it says, angles that you throw, attach to targets, and detonate into a suspending burst. Also, threatening final blows create a tangle. What it doesn't tell you is that it actually changes the trajectory your tangles travel when they are thrown. So let's just unequip the Wanderer aspect so you can get an idea. So we've just got a regular tangle here. We do not have the Wanderer aspect equipped. I'm just going to show you the normal trajectory that a tangle goes. So you throw it, grapple to it, and then it has a downwards trajectory like it normally does. That's how a tangle normally works. But with the Wanderer aspect equipped like we have now, upon throwing a tangle and grappling to it, you can see that it loses its downwards trajectory and continues to follow a straight path. It allows you to greatly increase the distance travelled upon grappling to a moving tangle and is a great movement tool that you guys can take advantage of inside of the game. That's all I have for you guys today though, so if you've enjoyed or found the video helpful, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.